In some documents, you may want to include an email address or web address. You can format these as hyperlinks, also known as links. This lets people access the information directly from Word. For example, I'd like to add an email address in the contact section of this newsletter. So I'll just type the address here, and when I press the spacebar or the Enter key on my keyboard, Word will automatically format the text as a link. You can do the same thing with a web address. In this example, we'll enter the address to a pool safety website, www.poolsafely.gov, and there we go. Creating links automatically doesn't always work, though. For example, if you want the text to be something other than the web address. In those situations, you can format any of your existing text as a link. I'd like to add a link to the City of Orlando's website, so you can go directly to the website while reading the document. I'll first select the text that I want to turn into a link, then right-click, and choose Link. You can also use the Link command on the Insert tab. Every link has two parts. The most important part is the address, which could be a web address, an email address, a file, or even a location in the same document. Just use the buttons here to navigate your options. In this example, we're going to enter www.cityoforlando.net. The second part of the link is the display text, which is the thing people will actually see when they read the document. The display text can be the same as the address, or just whatever you want. When you're ready, click OK, and now the text is formatted as a link. It's a good idea to test all of your links before sending out your document to make sure that they work. Normally, when you're in a web browser, you would just click the link to open it. But in Word, you have to hold Control on your keyboard while you click, just like it says in the instructions here. OK, the website opened correctly, which means our link is working. Let's go back to our document for one last thing. If you want to edit or remove a link, all you have to do is right-click, then make your selection from the menu. Now you know two different ways to create links in Word, by converting the text yourself or using the automatic formatting feature. GCF Global, creating opportunities for a better life.